Hi, my name is Bruce, and this is the C++ lesson on building in debug versus building in release. Before we begin this lesson, I want to point out that on my screen, I have code blocks open on the left, and I have the folder that my project is in open on the right. As stated in previous lessons, when you want to build and run your code, you can go to the build menu and click build and run. When we open up the bin folder where our executable was built and placed, you can see that there is a folder called debug. What does that mean? When you build a program, you actually have two different ways you can build it, debug mode and release mode. Let's talk about these modes and what they're for. Sometimes when you are writing code for your program, you make a mistake. When that happens, the program may still compile and run but the behavior of the program may not be what you expect it to be. It could be very frustrating trying to figure out what's wrong with the program. The process of finding and eliminating bugs from your program is called debugging. This is where the debug mode comes in. The debug mode gives the programmer access to a lot of extra information and tools that can help a programmer track down where the flaw in their logic is so that they may correct it. The downside of the debug mode is that the program has all this extra information attached to the program, making it slower and larger than it needs to be. When you are finished debugging your program and you are ready to share the program with the world, you should build the program in release mode. Release mode builds the program and optimizes the code as much as possible, making your code lighter and faster. The downside of release mode, however, is that because it makes optimizations to your code, it may not be able to be easily debugged because the code you wrote may not be accurately reflected in its final outcome. Now we'll talk about how to switch between building and debug and building and release. With code blocks, this is very simple. There is a drop down menu right on the toolbar that says whether you are building and debug or release. Simply click on the drop down and click the mode you wish to build in. After that, build your code and it will be built in the desired mode. This concludes the lesson on debug mode and release mode and how to build in these modes. In future lessons, we will cover the features of these modes in more detail. Thank you for watching.